Hey guys, welcome to the cabin. Glad you could join me one more time. As you can tell, I've got it pretty much finished up. There's a few small projects left over, but uh, overall I'm very happy with the result. Um, I've added a few details like the porch and then this overhang as well, which is great. It's going to make it a lot more comfortable to kind of be getting in and out. Um, everything worked out pretty good. There was some challenges with the door. I mean, obviously you're trying to get it kind of airtight. Uh, there's challenges with the stove and, and putting caulking around it to make sure that it was safe when we have a fire. Um, I still have a few things I need to make, like a wood overhang, like something to protect some dry wood. Um, and uh, I want to finish like a pit fridge, that kind of thing. Uh, so, But uh, in the end, it's pretty much where it needs to be. Uh, one of the great things about this whole project is all the wood I collected I have almost zero waste. I've used and managed to find or use everything I needed without having to throw something away. So even the supports for this guy here were just leftover bits of trees that I cut down and they were the ends of them and then I bent them over because I needed something that was more flexible. So I'm, I'm kind of happy with that because I didn't want to put a big footprint on the area. I knew I was going to either which way but the reality is, is that that when you can use your materials and use them up as best you can. It may not always look pretty, that's, you know, but you can't, I'm just building a cabin out in the woods, man. I'm just having a good time, you know. I'm not trying to reinvent the wheel or anything like that. I'm just trying to make a little space. So you got to play the good with the bad. And then, you know, we took our liberties with some of the porch stuff and the shelving and whatnot because that stuff, uh, that stuff is just, <laughs> it's a little harder to hand craft that, so. Anyways, I'm, I'm really happy with it. I'm excited to spend a night in it. Uh, I'd like to thank my girlfriend. She put a lot of effort into and putting up with me uh, since it's been two and a half weeks straight. I've been kind of absent from home <laughs> in that regard. But in the end, guys, I hope you like the videos. I hope you like the updates. I hope you like the product. Uh, you know, feel free to message me if you're interested in how I did it or some other questions about what I, what I did. And we'll go from there. But in the end, thanks for watching, guys. I really appreciate it. Take care.